All right, now, as the ice grows thicker on Idaho's lakes, anglers are headed out to their favorite fishing spots. This could be fun. Yeah. Local News 8's Seth Ratliff has a look at the cold weather hobby. In the dead of winter, when the ice grows two feet thick, anglers and weekend warriors drill a hole and set up their ice shanties to see if anything bites. I got into to ice fishing when I went to grad school in Iowa, and uh, that's that was something that a lot of my lab mates did, and uh, they helped teach me a lot about it, and so I got into it more and more, and then uh, transitioned to a few years down the, the road where I have all the gear and can I frequently go out just by myself and with other people uh, trying to catch fish to the ice. I got into ice fishing when I was younger. I used to go with my uh, family. Um, I'm from Wisconsin, so we used to go uh, pan fishing all the time, and um, that was uh, really fun, and we had big fish fries every Friday. And Henry's Lake in particular is one of the best places in the state to ice fish, according to the Department of Fish and Game. Fish biologist Nathan Tillerson says anglers have the potential to catch trophy trout any time they go there. We've got some of the largest Yellowstone cutthroat trout you'll see in the area. We have uh, some very large rainbow trout, um, Yellowstone cutthroat trout hybrids that people can catch. Uh, we currently have the catch and release state record for hybrid trout, and we just got the certified weight state record for Yellowstone cutthroat trout in Henry's Lake. However, ice fishing is not nearly as popular in the state as hunting or open water fishing, despite how easy it is to get started. There's a lot of really spe uh, specialized gear for ice fishing, like you can see here. But if you've got a regular old fishing rod and an ice chisel, you can go out and uh, uh, ice fish. And you can find someone else's hole that they've drilled previously and fish through that. Or you can make your own. But if you're really interested in picking up the hobby, there are some specialized gear or fun toys you might want in your ice hut. So over here we have something called a live scope, which is... Um, Essentially, you're, you're uh, shooting multiple sonar beams out into the water column that you can see um, exactly where the fish are coming in, how far out, how deep they are, uh, and what direction they're moving. But head out quick, fishing enthusiast. Catch and release season starts February 15th. In Island Park, I'm Seth Ratliff.